Lucia. <laughs> So um, now we have to take a bus to Mochi, which is where our next couch surfing goes to uh, live. So that's why we're on this bus. Um, but we were like the third people on, so we've had to wait for it. But it's, it's getting late, so we are thinking to maybe go to a hostel in Mochi and stay the night there. We made it to Mochi. We found the hostel. Good morning. Good morning. How is your sleep? Very good actually. Yeah. It started raining early this morning. Yeah. But we're on the rooftop having breakfast. It's a nice local coffee. Yes. It's a nice view of the town. We just spent money. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but it's a good purchase. Yeah, we got a couple. Um, so we got two, not a couple. Yeah, two puffer jackets. <laughs> um, they were expensive, but they like good quality. Like also, um, we wouldn't get a better price because this this is a hiking town because of Kilimanjaro. Yeah. So they sell them. And it's good brands. Good. It's like um, Columbia, Columbia and Eddie Bauer. Yeah. So, so it was forty dollars each. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but our reasoning is we're going to cold the countries now. It's all, and it's all winter. Is, it's getting winter. It's cold and. I like eventually we're going to be an island, so we'll definitely use them. Yeah, so we think it's a good purchase. Yeah, we'll, we'll see. make us all feel better, but and they squish because they're down jackets, they squish small, so it's not like going to take up a huge amount of space now. But. Yeah, so yeah, let's see. <laughs> So we made it to the hot springs. Yeah, um, yeah. so beautiful. It's really cool. The water is so clean. Mm. Oh, I got... <laughs> um, yeah, it's like crystal clear. Yeah, it's very cool. Mm. And it was super peaceful. It yeah. was like super quiet and then literally everyone around. The whole village. Yeah, <laughs> so everyone's jumping in the pool while the hot springs at the moment um, but once everyone's gone we'll show a video of like how beautiful it really is and like yeah, yeah. so nice but we get to camp here so I think we're gonna camp in this little spot over here because then we've got a little spot here got a little got a table, table. And there's Wake the hot spring. View. Yeah. yeah that's the plan <laughs> Do you like it? <laughs> They're crazy. Can you see them in the camera? Mm. They're all on my arm. I don't know how this is happening. How am I letting this happen? Just a free fish dead skin massage, pedicure. 
happening over here. Oh, they're all on my feet. Why do they like the feet? Check. Can you see them? Yeah. Oh, they're on my back. They're on my arms. Oh, it's getting a bit much. <laughs> How's the service, eh? I come bring you Yeah, yeah. Dinner is served. <laughs> yeah, so it's it's got louder. They're starting like to party a bit. But hey, hopefully they start leaving soon. <laughs> Because <laughs> we can only set up our tents when they leave. When they leave, because this is technically. Well, it's not. You're it's not, not that it's. To camp. Yeah, you're not meant to camp here, but if you pay the guard, you're allowed to camp here, and a lot of people actually know about it. Yeah. Um. So you have to wait for the guests to leave, and then you can set up. Yeah. So now Thank starting. <laughs> set up and ready so cool we're so excited we love this hey buddy this is so freaking cool we've got fireflies flying around there's like monkeys in the trees fish splashing it's like so awesome we left our head torches so we're literally just using our phone and the camera light because <laughs> it's all Here I'll clean that water is. I don't know if you can really see. Yeah, that's water. <laughs> that's not just a rock. Can you see the fire plants? Yeah, you can. <laughs> I'm the turtle whisperer. <laughs> Shame. Oh, look at his shawl. Yeah, something fell on him. Shame. Can't believe how many there are, and we're just swimming with all of these. This could be a turtle sanctuary. Yeah. So, we're going to say good night now. Good night. We're going to keep our battery on the camera just for yes. the morning. Yeah. yeah. So, we can show you hopefully a nice sunrise and how like, peaceful this place is. Yeah, when there's no 10 million people here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to wake up nice and early to enjoy the peace and quiet. Yeah. So, good night. We'll see you guys in good the morning. Night. your sleep fantastic <laughs> <laughs> yeah we didn't get that much sleep yeah it wasn't great it was quite hot yeah surprisingly like i mean it, it started to rain and the wind picked up as well but it was so warm in this tent because yeah. i think they use these tents to climb kilimanjaro so i think they some have some sort <laughs> yeah. of insulation because i was so hot i had to change into shorts yeah. and yeah and the tent's a little bit short for both of us yeah we're, we're quite tall people we so. should have probably changed to diagonal yeah that would have worked mm -hmm. yeah it's okay i did get some mm. periods of small small bits of sleep yeah <laughs> but yeah it's it been, wasn't bad it's been so nice and relaxing to wake up slowly to the sound of this rain yeah and so we got to use our new jackets oh yeah, yeah. check at us <laughs> great purchase great purchase check at our view What's the plan, Batman? Let's pack our bags and then at least we're ready for when the rain stops. Mm -hmm. And we also have a small problem. We need other tourists to come here on a tuk-tuk <laughs> for us then to take that tuk-tuk back to town. So it's raining, which means technically not a lot of people are going to want to come here. So let's see if we can actually get home. It's yeah, going to be interesting.
I'm not looking good. <laughs> <laughs> not at all. What was for breakfast? Digestive biscuits, some yum yum peanut butter, some cranberry juice. Oh yeah. They're actually really nice. These biscuits. Mm. camping adventure was over but it was so much fun Lance and I was so happy that we did this even though it cost a little bit of money and it was a little bit out of the way it was so worth it <clears throat> we we're literally the only ones here we had the whole morning to ourselves swimming we felt like little wildlings in the jungle so yeah it's been so nice really really recommend So this is where we're staying at the moment. Yeah. So this is our couch surf. Very nice people have luckily hosted us. So we're going to be staying here for the next few days. Yeah, so this is the house. We'll take you inside to show you around. Come, let me show you inside. So this is the lounge area where we sit and eat and watch TV. This is King and Elizabeth, our very welcoming host. <laughs> and then this is the kitchen. So we were sitting here making the chapati and outside they cook on a fire for dinner and boil water and things. And then here we have a toilet and a shower where you can do bucket, like a bucket bath. So that's and then let me show you our room. So this is our room. How nice! We get our own private room, double bed. So cool. So cool. We've been so welcomed by King and Elizabeth and their family. They've cooked for us and taught us all about the different culture and tribes and things like that here in Tanzania. So yeah, we feel very welcome and so at home here. So Asante Sana, King and Elizabeth. <laughs> <laughs> We're just going to a next door neighbor to see her house. They invited us to come have a look. <laughs> Lance has a new friend. Yes, buddies. <laughs> From not wanting to come near you yeah. to not letting your hand go. Is that right? Come on. Where are you going? Where are you going? <laughs> are you going home? Bye. So we are on our walk back home. They are such lovely people here. They welcome us into their houses and you know, they made tea for us and oh, it was just so nice. And they're taking a lot of photos and all that, but yeah, you know, we're on our way back to our host. And then yeah, you know, we're gonna make some dinner and then chill for the rest of the evening. Guys with our new friend. So Samrat has been so scared of us and hasn't wanted to speak to us or come near us and now she literally just wants love the whole time.
getting my hair braided. <laughs> it's looking very good. Getting your hair braided. <laughs> the chicken's just chilling here. <laughs> this chicken. I already forgot Tambi. What is it? Tambi. Tambi. This is called Tambi. It's like a little snack. Um, yeah, it's made from a certain flour and it's very yeah. tasty. It's Elizabeth's little business. Mm. She makes it and then sells it to a shop and the shop sells it on. Yeah, very nice. For a whole audience. Yeah, this guy's doing some washing with an audience. Jumbo! Jumbo! <laughs> going for a walk? Yes, we're going to check out some farms. <laughs> We just went for a walk to see all the neighboring farms. Some have livestock, some are growing sunflowers, some are just growing maize or banana trees, avocado trees, all sorts here. So it's beautiful and green and so lush everywhere. Okay, so we just jumped off a taxi. We have arrived at a Catholic church that also has like a little farm behind it. Um, and they like to make a little bit of extra income. They sell livestock. Um, so yeah, we've come to buy chicken. <laughs> so it's our like little going away present. We told them that yeah, we would like buy chicken like for like a last dinner. Um, and obviously the local way is to buy a live chicken. So yeah, it's definitely a new experience for us, but yeah, it's gonna be cool. So I'll show you which one we choose. <laughs> Got a little chicken handbag. Living <laughs> Okay, so we're back home after the taxi ride. Got the chicken in hand. So the next part might not be the, the most <laughs> yeah, great to watch. Might get a little bit um, gruesome. So yeah, now we have to do the actual preparation of the chicken. So yeah, let's see how that goes. How's this drumstick? Check that <laughs> out. That's insane. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait. From farm to table. <laughs> mm. Good. That's good. Very good. And just like that, a whole week has come to an end. We're so sad to be leaving, actually. Yeah, it's been so good. We really enjoyed it here. Yeah, it's like our own little home in this local village now. And shame, the boys are so sad that we're leaving. It's literally like almost midnight now and we felt too bad to come to bed so we've like been sitting with them in the lounge. I don't know how they're still awake to be honest but <laughs> um, they have been so welcoming and yeah have made us feel a part of the family so it is quite bittersweet that we're leaving but we'll definitely definitely be back. 
but for now we need to go to bed and wake up early tomorrow pack the last few things have some more our last local Tanzanian tea and then hit the road to Kenya <laughs> <laughs>